and the boom gates come down, the train then passes through safely. In the case of a tram square, the signaler ensures that trams are safe and clear of the level crossing, and then we manually activate the boom gates, close pedestrian gates, and signal that train through. As the train approaches the tram square, the driver needs to slow their speed uh, to 20 kilometers over the crossing, and they need to be on the lookout for a signal that gives them permission to proceed through that section. It's important that we move through the rail square slowly. There are things called section isolators, and that's where we can potentially lose power as we're going across the rail square, something we have to navigate through. Accelerate to about 10 kilometers an hour, take your foot off the accelerator, and just coast the whole way over. Passenger experience going through the rail square is pretty bumpy. On a typical day, we can actually see traffic bank up as far as the eye can see. It's heavily impactful on the local